There's Dan Henderson. Yeah, that's right. That's why I was waiting. There's, she, there's Chevra. Okay, we're starting to get people. Kingston, can you bring Julian from the uh, attendees group? Oh, there's Tom. There right now. Okay, we're starting to get. We almost have a quorum. Mm -hmm. okay. We have a quorum. One, two. And Kingston, three, four, uh, five. Yeah, Rector we have a is also in that group. Okay. I think I count six, so I think you have a quorum. But there's two more coming apparently from the other. There's Manu. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. Anyone else in the other group that we need to bring over? I'm not seeing anyone else. Okay. Can they can the people from the other group hear us? No, yeah. Yes, hey, I, hey. I was in the other group and I could hear you. Okay, okay good. Okay, well then let's go ahead and call the uh, meeting, special meeting of the Metropolitan uh, Metro to order, uh, special board of directors special meeting on December 10th and ask for a roll call. And Director Duca. Director Colin Terry Johnson. Present. Director Koenig. Here. Director Lind. Here. Uh, Director McPherson is out. Uh, Director Myers. Present. Director Northcutt. Uh, Director Pegler. Here. Director Peterson. Uh, Kristen, I can see you, but I can't hear you. President, can you hear me now? Yeah. Yes. Okay, thank, thank you. you. And Director Rockin. Here. All okay. right. And we have quorum, and I don't think we've anybody else has joined the. Oh, I'm sorry. And then we have uh, ex officio uh, Henderson. Right here. Okay. So we do have quorum. Thank you. All right, thank you, Donna. Um, today's meeting is being broadcast by Community Television Santa Cruz County. And uh, I'd ask if there are any board of directors comments. I see none, none, okay. Um, oral and written reports to the board of directors. Do we have uh, any oral reports? Okay. There are none. Good. And uh, labor organization communication. See none. Madam Chair, you have oh, Dean Sandoval. Yeah, he's trying to switch to see. All right, uh, then James, my board is not changing. Ah, James, here we go. Uh, James Sandoval here, uh, union representative for the fixed route operators and paratransit operators at Metro. Um, I sent you all an email. Um, it's a questionnaire our union and SEIU came up with on a uh, subject matter that are important to us to know about the applicants for the CEO general manager position, and we hope you um, consider them in the application process. And um, Another thing we were thinking about is a advisory committee that we could um, hopefully create with a, a few union representatives and a few representatives or from our union and a few representatives from each department at Metro. So that way we could uh, collaborate on the, you know, um, on the person that we're hoping that we could bring into Metro. Um, and another thing too is we hope that this uh, recruitment a firm um, is also, um, they support the ideals in Santa Cruz County as being pro-labor. So that's all I have to say, thank you. Thank you, James. Do we have anyone else from, no other hands? Okay, uh, then Mac, uh, do we have anyone from Mac? Uh, no. Okay. Okay. Any um, 
Additional documentation. Received. And there is none. Okay. So we will move to a motion on the consent agenda, approving the minutes and. Uh, Make that motion. I'll second that. I'll second that motion. Motion is second. Ask for a roll call. Okay, and that was Larry that made the first. And yes. Rod, yes. Mike Rodkin, the second. The second. Okay, thank you. Uh, Director, can we Bird, check for um, um, public comment, please? Oh, sorry public. about that. <laughs> sorry. Thank you, Julie. Um, do we have any public comment? And let me get that. I see no hands. Mm -hmm. No. All right. Thank you, Julie. Uh, now roll call. Uh, Director Dutra. Yes. Uh, oh, you're present there. All right. Thank you. <laughs> and Director Collentary Johnson. Yes. And Director Koenig. Yes. Director Lynn. Aye. Uh, Director Myers. Aye. Director Northcutt. Aye. Uh, Director Pegler. Aye. Director Peterson. Aye. Director Rockman. Aye. Okay, and the motion passes. Okay, then we go to regular agenda, um, public employee appointments of government code section. And um, that will be in closed session. So we will be moving to closed session for public employee appointments, government code section 54957. CEO slash GM position and interim CEO GM position. And we will report back after our closed session. You, you should ask if people have any comments on the closed session item. And I do see Edward uh, Montesino with a hand up. Eduardo, go ahead. Eduardo, sorry. I know that. We're not hearing you. Um, okay. Eduardo, uh, we can't hear you. Now you're muted. It shows you're muted. Now you're not. Still don't hear you though. <laughs> Eduardo, we are, you are uh, unmuted on our end and available to speak. And it looks like you're unmuted on your end. So feel free. Looks like a technical difficulty of some kind. Let's see if there, I thought I saw another hand. If there is, we'll go to the next and then come back to Edward. There's someone else that would have wanted to come on, comment on our closed session. Not seeing anything. No. And Eduardo's hand is down now, so. Not sure if he wants yeah. to speak or not. Okay. Maybe he can email a comment yeah. too. That, uh, Eduardo, if you did have a comment and having technical difficulties, please feel free to email us uh, or, or me, and we will, any of us, and we'll forward it to the board. Thank you. If there's no one else, then we will go ahead and move into closed session. My Eduardo, second. you could also call me on my cell phone if nothing else works. This is Mike Rodkin. Looks like he, he is left. Okay. okay. We will move to closed session and return with the report after our closed session. Okay. And everyone got their link okay this morning? Oh, let me check. Let me check that. Hold on. Before you let me go. It, it uh, came from Ian Barry this morning. Okay. I got that one. I see it. Thank you. All right. See everybody in a moment.
We have to go out of this one, right, Mike? Yeah. Okay. All right, so I think we have everyone here. You know, I get let Julianne and uh, returning and, and calling the meeting back to order from closed session and just uh, re reporting out that we had a discussion on the recruitment process. And one of the key things that we want to share again is that we, are, we will be including and encouraging public input from employees, from the unions, from stakeholders. Uh, the the uh, recruiter will has an understanding that we want this process to be very inclusive. And any of uh, anyone from employees, from staff, from unions is encouraged to continue providing uh, information on what their uh, desires for the new candidate or the new CEO position should include. And it will be a confidential confidential process. We want to that everyone that uh, is interested in the position feel comfortable applying and that this uh, their application will be confidential so it doesn't uh, interfere with their current employment. But uh, we will um, continue to be very inclusive and, and we'll make repeated notices that, uh, that you are encouraged to participate and provide information in the process. So. The, we also discussed the interim position, but we have not made a selection at this point. We'll be uh, following up on a, on a separate meeting. Is there anything from the public, anyone from the public that uh, wants to comment on this action on my report? Okay. Julie, is there anything I, further that I should announce? Uh, you, you can announce the next meeting if you'd like. Yeah. Let me just refresh. Okay. The uh, next board of directors meeting will be Friday, January 28th, 2019, uh, 2022 at 9 a.m. via teleconference. And uh, we will be looking at uh, a special meeting in the next week and that will be announced to finalize the interim position. Is that correct? Okay. Okay, unless there's any other comments from either the board or the public, then we will adjourn this meeting. Let me make sure. Okay, thanks, everyone. Don't see any hands. Thank you all. Happy holidays and stay safe. You as well. Thank you, everyone.